If a pit of charged creepers can't kill me, the next logical step is the end. And nope, I survived, and I got a bunch of creeper heads in return. Exactly a stack and 17 creeper heads. What's up my diamond block, it's, it's your boy on Fire Jam, and welcome... Where the legends tell of an add-on so powerful that it stopped you from dying. Let me show you right now. I just gotta wait for... Now we go ahead and set our game up to create to survival. We didn't take any fall damage. So all my goal is to see what can cause So if we want to try to find a loophole with this add-on. Like the first logical step is to dig down past bedrock. So let's put something easy to break, like dirt, for example. And then let's set ourselves into survival. And see what happens when you mine this dirt. Um... Hello? Um... <laughs> I didn't even die. Even the void doesn't kill you? What the heck? Okay, well I'm sure we'll find some... Wait, wait a minute. Ooh, cool, I found a cave. <laughs> Sorry, I get so easily distracted. The point is... That is definitely not going to work as a loophole. If you think we can find a loophole in this add-on, make sure to like and subscribe and hit the bell. We are so close to 100, not 100, we are so close to 500 subscribers. That is insane. So we are going to try different death methods. I guess we are going to try the falling blocks. We'll also try pointed dripstone. Okay, so that is sometimes effective at killing people. And while we're at it, we might as well get an anvil. Let's set our time to day. We will mess around with nighttime very soon. But not yet. And let's go with lime concrete powder. Wait, what am I kidding? Of course I need to stack them on top of each other. Am I dumb? Okay. 
we are going to try different methods of suffocation. Except for the anvil. The anvil doesn't count as a form of suffocation. Okay, now slash game mode S. Wait. Dang it. It does exist though. I've used slash game mode survival before. try this again. This time, let's go into survival. Just pushes me out of the way. Okay, let's try sand next. Okay, nothing happened. Okay, red sand does not do anything when it falls. Neither does an anvil. Tis, a, tis but a scratch. Okay. Lime concrete powder just moves me out of the way. Okay. Okay, we are we have given ourselves a netherite pickaxe for the sake of it not taking so long. It just broke. Okay, next is a cactus. Okay, now this thing is so powerful, it can literally destroy netherite. So if this doesn't kill me, I don't know what can. I'm not taking any damage. Okay, my next idea involves bone mealing a sapling. Well, I mean, I got stuck in the... So I guess that's something, but no damage. Now, guys, I know you might be thinking, I'm Fire Jim. Why are you placing? Why do you have to be there? That's such an absurd way. But actually, I have a lot of experience with sweet berries, and in fact, I have a lot of experience with dying to sweet berries. You can look up the add-on survival series for that. Link in the description. But um Okay, I'm just able to walk I'm just able to run right through the sweet berries. So I tried bone mealing them. Let's see if that works. I mean it slows me down, but it's not doing any damage. Okay, there's one thing that could have killed me if I try if I waited long enough, and that is powder snow from the 1.17 update. So let's do this. Nope, I'm just perfectly fine in extreme cold temperatures. <laughs> okay. I mean, I can take extreme cold, but clearly I shouldn't be able to take pure heat, right? Nope, I most certainly can. This is not a retexture. Look. Like, this is not a retexture of magma blocks. Like, this is magma blocks. And it's not killing me. If there's nothing 
that gets people killed more than taking honeycomb from a bee nest. I don't know what does. Or I guess I could just hit them. Let's hit on some more of them. Let's punch on all of them. And they're not even doing anything about it. They're literally the worst. They can't even... Can't even do damage to me. I wonder if I can kill them all with a netherite pickaxe. Ooh, I forgot there were some in there. That was unsuccessful. Okay, come on. Patch of Wither Roses has gotta work. I mean, I think I might have found a bit of a loophole if it weren't for me not taking damage. These Wither Roses would kill me. Maybe we need a bit more power. Okay, let's get right up next to the Wither. Is the wither even trying? Come on, where is he at? Okay! So it doesn't seem like I can get the wither to even come near me. If a pit of charged creepers can't kill me, the next logical step is the end. And nope, I survived, and I got a bunch of creeper heads in return. Exactly a stack and 17 creeper heads. Well, I don't know what odds the nether has of killing me. <laughs> Let's see what odds the nether has of killing me. Keep in mind, I have nothing except for 64 st stone, 64 obsidian, a flint and steel, and a netherite pickaxe. I have no armor, no real weapons, no nothing. Can the nether kill me? Okay. Seems like there's no way but the lava. Okay, maybe if we...
Mann. Maybe if I get under the taller trees. J slash fact at s instant damage fifty. Wait, no, one hundred fifty. Okay, there is only one logical next step. If the overworld and the nether can't kill me, surely the end can. Keep in mind, my hunger bar is literally zero. Let's just get a bunch of dudes angry. Okay. Okay. Well, the Endermen are following me like a bunch of loyal viewers. Hello. Thank you for watching my videos. Where's the dragon? Okay. Well, it doesn't seem like the dragon is coming anywhere near the portal. So there's one thing I want to test. And that is, can the end void at least kill me? Nope. Welp, it seems like there is only one loophole in a world where you cannot die, and that is slash kill. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this little bit of a challenge. If you did, make sure to- wait, actually first there's skeletons. Okay, yeah, but if you enjoyed this challenge, make sure to like and subscribe and hit the bell, and also, 
make sure to let me know. Do you actually want me to play the McMackenstein data pack for another video? But anyway, guys, I will see you on the flip side of the trident. Goodbye. <laughs>